Hello YouTube land. Okay, in this video, I'm going to show you something that's missing from this floor. I'm using a slotted drum sander. Let's take a look at that first. Okay. Let me see the slot. There you go, a slotted, a slotted drum sander. Now, what's a very common problem with that machine? Let's go back and take a look. Okay, the, the, the number one problem, especially with fine sanding, is chatter marks in the floor. However, you'll notice this floor has none. Oh, by the way, there'll be a disclaimer in the description. Make sure you read it. Um, also, any links for anything in this video will be in there if need be. Anyway, I fine sanded this floor. This floor has been rough sanded and I fine sanded it with the drum sander and absolutely no chatter marks. And I want to tell you or show you what I think is the number one problem and how to avoid chatter marks. Well, let's get to the drawing board over here. Uh, let me see. I'm trying to get a great view. And hopefully, hopefully you guys will also hear me, no problem. Okay, I'm going to load this. Now, I got a brand new drum on this, which is definitely a plus. Okay, 
The key is, is not to over tighten it. I'm only giving it what it needs. So, when you make it too tight, this part right here, which gives you the chatter marks, if you make it too tight, this becomes hard. So as it rotates, it's like bam, 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 bam. And the second tip I will give you is use a minimum of drum pressure. Because that's another thing. If you're pressing the drum too much, then that groove, once again, is being forced to violently hit the floor, and thus you have chatter marks. So, I will be uh, posting another video, I believe, on uh, how to properly fine sand, you know, because there's a different speed. Slow, rough sanding is a way slower speed than fine sanding. So I will post a video just to give you an idea of how it's supposed to be done. And realize this is for demonstration purposes of how I do it. There will be a disclaimer in there. And if you take any information or duplicate anything in any of my videos, you do so at your own risk. Um, with that being said, I hope you found this useful. More tips, tricks, and a variety of content heading your way. If you like what you see, please hit the like button and subscribe button. Peace out and have a fantastic day.